welcome back. And 3A, four teams remain from Acadiana, but three of those teams are double-digit seeds. Yeah, so it's a trio of, of Cinderella, so to speak. They joined five, fifth seed Kaplan. Crowley faced Jennings in Jeff Davis Parish. And in St. Landry, Northwest hosting West Feliciana. Now let's head out to Prairie as the Raiders hosted their first quarterfinals game in program history. First play from scrimmage, Northwest trying to impose their will. Keyshawn Jackson running over anyone that dared to arm tackle him. A 40 yard run from the big man to start the game out, but the drive would stall out inside the 10. Absolutely. Now it's the Saints turn on offense. Derek Turner taking cues from Drew Brees. He heaves it deep for Kyrie Morrison. He's going to fall inside the twin. Westfell would score a few plays later to make it 7-0. Next possession for the Saints. Derek Turner again is going long, and this time he is going to find Darius Davis, and he's going to do a little cha-cha to dance his way into the end zone. 14-0 West Feliciana. Now the theme in this one, Andrew, was big plays for Westfell. None bigger than this one. Second quarter, Tur Turner surveying, but the Raiders defense seemed to have him trapped. But after a few jukes, he laterals to De Devon Smoke Harris. That was a lateral who makes one guy miss, and then he just gets silly with the joystick. He had all the jukes to find the end zone and make it 21-0. Now Northwest down 28 right before halftime, but trying to find life on offense. Montez Sam throws it up for August Petrie, and check this out literally snatches the ball away from the defender's hands. You got Maul, son. The Raiders weren't able to capitalize, though. Northwest's season ends with a 42-7 loss. Now, West Feliciana facing the winner of Crowley and Jennings in next week's semifinal. This a defensive affair. Crowley taking the handoff here early in the game. We will get there, and there it comes, taking the handoff. But you know what? Davian Madden had himself a night. He gets the tackle, stalling the Gents' drive. Madden not done yet. The Gents' next drive coming up with another stop. Madden number 13, looking like you're going to see him in Madden in a few years. I was about to say he's all mad. That was defense <laughs> was the story of the first half. Third quarter, first drive of the second. Darian Akane breaking through the first points of the game. Bulldogs up 7-0. How about another score for good measure? It's going to be the running back again. This time opposite side of the field is going to punch it in. And that's your ball game, folks. Jennings heading to the semifinals for the first time since 2013. 14-0 for Crowley. Kaplan on the road at St. James tonight. We start and it's 24-14 in the third quarter. We're having some technical difficulties with Ooh. that video. We may have it later, but Kaplan wins it 39-22. Now in the opposing quarterfinals matchup, it's going to be Richwood. Uh, actually getting the win over Sterlington. And so Kaplan and Sterlington will face off, or Kaplan and Richwood will face off in that championship. Hopefully we can have those highlights for you a little bit later. So it's now halftime here for Friday Night Football. Coming yep. up, STM looking for a third straight trip to the Dome, taking on a very good and unbeaten De La Salle team in New Orleans. That's a good De La Salle team. But now let's introduce you to our next top squad tonight, presented by Conference. 